on Chapter 4. I'll show you how to test your watch face on the real gear device and how to upload to the store. To deploy your watch face, you need a Tizen Author certificate. Click Project, then Author Certificate, then you'll see a pop up window. If you don't have a Tizen Author certificate, click Generate a new certificate signing request. Else, Click I already have a Tizen Author certificate. Then provide the certificate file and its password. Let's try to get a new certificate. Click Next. Then fill in the mandatory fields including the password. Click Next to get. Now, enter your Samsung account ID and password. Note that you must not lose the certificate file in the key store because it will be used when you upgrade the watch after being uploaded to the store. Click Done to complete. For the next step, we need to connect the Gear S2 to the PC. For this, both of them must be in the same network. Prep the gear by turning the debugging feature on. Bluetooth off. And connect to Wi-Fi. Back to the PC screen. To run your watch face on the real gear device, you need to get a distribution certificate. This certificate means that your device is allowed to install watch face. Go to project, then distributor certificate. You can see the connected device ID here. If not, close the window, click run on device, click scan devices to connect gear with PC manually. Keep your gear screen on to avoid terminating the connection. Loading progress takes a few seconds, then you can see the circle icon with IP address. This means your gear device is successfully connected. Then again, click Distributor Certificate. Now the connected device ID is entered. Enter your Samsung account details and you'll get Distributor Certificate successfully. Okay, you're all set to install your watch face to the gear device. Now to proceed with the installation. Build the project. And click Run on Device by choosing your device on the list. Checking on the gear, the watch face should be installed. Let's set it as current watch face. Press and hold the watch face. You can see the available watch faces on the screen. You can find your watch face at the end of the list. Voila! our own watch face, live on the Gear S2. Now this is the final step. Let's upload the watch face to the store. Click Upload to Market button on the top right corner. The Samsung app's web page is opened. Click Login and enter your ID and password. If you don't have an ID, create one. Now after logging in, 
you'll be redirected to the new application registering page. Enter the application title. along with a simple explanation. Upload the icon. And at least four screenshots. Select Gear, then Watch Face for the category Age, All, Supported Language, English. Now enter your email address on the Support Email field, then click Save. Go back to the top, then click Binary on the left menu list. On this page, you can upload the binary file. Check standalone on gear app type and scroll down to click add binary. The resolution for gear S2 is 360 by 360. Check no for Google mobile service. Click binary upload button. Then browse for the binary file. Click Save to close the pop-up window. Then you'll see a pop-up again, then just click OK. Now it's time to move to the Country and Price page. Set the price to free and click Save. Click the OK button on the pop-up again. On the top right corner, click Submit. Lastly, on the pop-up window, click Yes you'll be redirected to the My Application page where you can check the status of your watch face registration. When validation is complete, you start to sell it. I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. For increase, please post your questions on the official forum at developer.samsung.com. Don't forget to give a thumbs up on this video and subscribe to the Samsung Developers channel. Thanks for watching.